Namaste everyone welcome to our YouTube channel Dr Vishay Kumar today we are going to learn the histology of uterine tube which is called fallopian tube and selfing uterine tube here we will see infula with the meso selfing this is the outer structure this one is serosa of the visceral peritoneum form the outermost layer of the uterine tube which is connected to the meso selfing ligament of the superior margin of the broad ligament and this one is arterioles and venules numerous arterioles and venules are present now you can see on your screen that we are making the outer longitudinal layer and actually this uh, outer longitudinal layer is separated from the inner circular layer by the interstitial connective tissue this is outer longitudinal muscle layer and in pink color i am just separating everywhere this one is called the interstitial connective tissue this interstitial connective tissue separate the inner circular layer and outer longitudinal layer now you can see on your screen that this one is inner circular layer it is not muscular layer it is only inner circular layer i have written wrong you can correct it you can see this is the mucosa of uterine tube consist of a simple columnar ciliated and non ciliated epithelium the mucosa of the ampulla exhibit the most extensive mucosal fold this fold form irregular lumen in the uterine tube here is the mucosal fold and here is the lumen of uterine tube here is the meso selfing ligament this complete the uterine tube along with the ampulla with the meso selfing now we will see the proliferative or follicular phase of uterine tube here you can see the surface of endometrium which is lined by the simple columnar epithelium cell this is lining epithelium this lining epithelium is mainly the simple columnar epithelial cell and here also the simple columnar epithelium cells is present but this structure is called uterine gland this all are uterine gland we'll level all the uterine gland is form a long tubular uterine gland lining epithelium extend down to the connective tissue of lamina propria and form a long tubular uterine gland here is the lining epithelium and this one is uterine gland this round circle structure is called coiled arteries this coiled arteries are mainly present in the deeper part of endometrium this is called lamina propria lamina propria lining epithelium uterine gland and arterioles all together is coming under the endometrium this one is funcionalis layer and here is basilis layer funcionalis and basilis layer here is the smooth muscle 
and this one is longitudinal section of a smooth muscle a smooth muscle longitudinal and this one is also a smooth muscles with blood vessels but this one is cross section of a smooth muscle here the smooth muscle cross section and longitudinal and cross section of a smooth muscle is known as myometrium we call this one is myometrium and this two layer is separated by interstitial connective tissue here is blood vessels thank you please do like subscribe and share this video with your friends